The city of San Diego is moving forward with a lawsuit against Scripps Health, alleging a mentally ill elderly patient was illegally discharged. CBS 8 has been working to investigate several reports of alleged patient dumping by local hospitals. As David Godfordson reports, the city's lawsuit claims the man was put in a group home with no supervision after his Medicare insurance ran out. When a hospital takes care of a patient, they're supposed to ensure that they are discharged in a responsible manner. The patient, J.N., in his late 60s, was admitted in 2019 to Scripps Mercy Behavioral Health in Hillcrest. He had a history of schizophrenia, depression, hallucinations, and suicidal behavior, including overdosing, attempting to get hit by a truck, and threatening to cut his throat with a knife. Doctors recommended J.N. be placed under public conservatorship and transferred to a locked, skilled nursing facility, according to a lawsuit filed against Scripps Health by the city of San Diego. City attorney Mara Elliott says instead, the hospital released him to this independent living group home on 71st Street off Imperial Avenue, where inspectors later found him living in squalor. He was in terrible condition. He um, had open sores. He didn't know where he was. He thought he was in another generation. Uh, he couldn't tell us very much about his situation at all. The motivation for his release from the hospital was twofold, according to Elliot. One, no local skilled nursing homes were available. And two, JN's Medicare benefits had expired. First of all, this person never should have been released into an independent living facility. He's by no means independent. And secondly, this health care system skirted the laws to save a few bucks. Last week, a judge ruled the city's lawsuit alleging elder abuse and unfair business practices can move forward. But Scripps Health is fighting back, saying in court papers that J.N. or his conservator never objected to him being discharged. And in a statement to CBS 8, a spokesman said, quote, discharging any patient prematurely because their insurance expired is inconsistent with anything we do or believe in. With the help of the county, JN is now living at a skilled nursing facility near San Bernardino. We want an order from the court determining that the behavior that we are complaining about is not up to standard. It does not abide by the law. Scripps Health sent us a statement saying they're looking forward to trying the case on its merits in court. A trial date has now been set for May of next year. In Hillcrest, David Goffertson, CBS 8.